This is Win News. The Altina Wildlife Park at Darlington Point has become the first privately owned zoo in Australia to breed the critically endangered African hunting dog. The zoo is celebrating the birth of six puppies. They're the cute puppies helping to give a rare species hope of survival. The arrival of new African wild dogs, also known as Cape hunting dogs, creating plenty of excitement at the Altina Wildlife Park. The dogs that have bred here today um, are six boys. Uh, they will probably be moved on to another zoo. Uh, hopefully one of the, the boys or two of the boys will be selected for breeding for, for, for the coming years. While they seem harmless now, this species of wild dog is very difficult to handle and as adults are dangerous and volatile animals. The Cape hunting dogs are the most successful hunters in Africa. About 70% of all their, their um, attempts to hunt is successful. They can run up to 15, 20 kilometres and to set up an ambush up the front and they have like a relay race. So as one dog gets tired, another one takes over. Altina has been commended for breeding the dogs after other zoos had zero success. Only four breeding packs are currently in Australia, but there's a real chance of boosting numbers thanks to the new litter. After the weekend's success, the wildlife park is now turning its attention to another animal. Our next species that we're, we're uh, building the enclosure for now is the uh, common marmosets, which are a monkey from Brazil. Only a small little thing, it stands about eight inches tall. BJ Conkey, Win News.